Hey everyone, Ariel Adams here with TheBlogTree.com. This is a very special watch. You may have never heard of the brand. If you did, I promise you, you've probably not seen this watch um, or maybe any of the watches of the brand in person. This is a very, very cool piece. This is from a brand called Nubeo. And this is the Arctic Snowmobile Adventure Chronograph Limited Edition watch. It's sort of an evolution on their Jellyfish watch. And this limited edition was done uh, for... I guess a snowmobile adventure in the Arctic. Um, it's limited to 300 pieces. Um, I'm not really sure where you can find these watches these days. I'm not sure what's going on with the brand. Um, they've been going through some interesting times uh, because of uh, various uh, events that occurred in the watch industry over the last few years. Um, they may be back. There probably are some of these watches floating around the world. They're very, very neat. The attention to detail is fantastic. And the design is great. Designer is a, a guy, really cool guy, Spaniard named uh, Ivan Castro. And this sort of brand was his baby. And he did some very interesting things with it. The most famous thing the brand did was partner with Kobe Bryant for a watch called the Black Mamba. Um, I'm not sure exactly what the status of the Black Mamba is right now, um, but that was sort of a big deal for them, and that was a pretty cool piece. If you look here at the side when the uh, sort of the strap is folded like that, you can see kind of that jellyfish look, very sort of organic curve there, very, very nice. And here along in the rubber strap, there's these black segments. These are actually ceramic, and the idea was to have sort of a vertebrate type of a look there, which I thought was just, you know, very cool, and it, and it moved and just sort of a neat thing. The, the entire case is just like extremely detailed. Um, very, very interesting. One of the cool things is the back here. You can see it's curved and there's several pieces here, but it's very, very flush, which is really, really nice. And wearing it is comfortable. You can see there it has a 7750 in there, but it's very uh, decorated and there's that custom um, automatic rotor there for Nubea, which is black with this cool uh, polishing on there. It's just a really, really neat piece overall. Uh, the dial is very, very detailed. Um, there's different layers to it. Everything is very, very crisp. This is a great watch um, that is an example of an instance where there isn't necessarily innovation in the movement, but the case itself has a lot of detail in there. So, yes, this has a 7750, and yes, that's a movement you can find in much lower priced watches, but I promise you, you're not going to find them in watches that have this type of detail on the dial and the case. And that's really where you're paying for in a watch like this, is all those different details. So, for example here, look at the bezel. This black section is actually rubber, and all these uh, numbers are very, very finely cut metal. And it just has this really, really cool look to it. The dial is amazing. I can't even really explain. There's some glare there going on. But the dial is just really, really fantastic. You can see the Nubeo um, uh, logo there in the crown. And I like here, it's kind of interesting. It's reverse. The chronograph pushers are actually small. <laughs> so the crown is really big and the chronograph pushers are small. Nice, large lugs. Just fantastic um, detailing all around. I, can't, I just can't stress that enough. The cool black big buckle there. Um, one thing which is interesting about this is as avant-garde as the design is, it's extremely legible. Um, that's one of the reasons I like wearing this watch so much because I can read it very easily. The hands stand out. I can see the chronograph dials very well. And this should be a lesson to people that when you're making something which is kind of crazy out there like this, you don't need to abandon basic laws of legibility and ergonomics. You can see it looks comfortable, it sits on your wrist well. It's a cool watch. The watch is actually 43 millimeters wide. Um, depending on how you look at it, it could look bigger or smaller, but it's, it's, a, it's a good size watch. It's, it's, it's pretty intense, it's pretty cool. Um, like I said, the Arctic Snowmobile chronograph was limited to 300 pieces. Um, find some out there. If you can find a new bail somewhere, I don't think you'll be disappointed. Um, it's quite a remarkable thing, and it'll really sort of reinvigorate your interest in uh, some of the more smaller independent brands. Price on this, um, I'm not really sure. It was over $10,000. Um, I can't say exactly how much, but uh, again, this is the Nubeo Arctic Snowmobile Adventure Chronograph, and you can see more on blogtoread.com. Thanks.